Hey guys, Phil here from jailbreakitouch.com. Today what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to install Customize 2.0 on your iTouch. One of the first things you need to know is you have to have a jailbroken iTouch in order to do this. So you can visit our website, once again, jailbreakitouch.com and jailbreak it. Um, you also want to go to thespicychicken.com and you want to register uh, your iTouch so the application works. So what you want to do here is you want to click on Installer. You want to click on Sources, Edit, Add, and you want to add the Spicy Chicken uh, repo, which is customizeapp.com slash plist slash installer, which you'll see at the bottom of your screen. So once you've installed that, what you want to do is you want to head to Install, and you want to see if you have the BSD subsystem. Now, if you jailbroke this with Xiphone, uh, 3.0 it will automatically put the BSD system as you can see under my uninstall you can see the BSD subsystem so that needs to be there if not you can just go into your all packages and do a search for it the next thing you need to do is go under let's go under tweaks uh, 113 uh, sorry with that you want to go under tweaks 114 and you'll see one that says SUD lib fix so you want to install this Okay, from there what you need to install next is Summerboard. So what you can do is you can click on All Packages, click on the search button, and just start typing in Summer. And you'll see where it comes up with Summerboard. So click on Summerboard and install it. And it's going to tell you you got to restart your iPhone, so that's fine. So what we're going to do is we're going to click OK. We're going to exit out of the summer board. Or sorry, exit out of the installer. We're going to click on the SMB preferences. We're going to launch it. Then we're going to close it. And now what we're going to do is we're going to reboot the iTouch. So just hold down your power button at the top and slide the power off. Okay, so now that's off, and we'll turn it back on. Okay, so now we're back up and running, and of course, once again, my eye touch is really bright. So we'll do. We're just going to change the settings here. Okay, so now we got to do is go back to the installer. once you're in there, we now want to install Customize 2.0. So you can just click on Install All Packages again, click on the search, and just start typing in Customize. And there's Customize 2.0. want to install it. Excellent. Exit out of the installer. We, what, you want, what we want to do is we want to launch, customize. And then we want to close it. So the next thing we want to do now is we want to launch the summer board. We want to set the theme to customize. And we want to make sure that everything is off with the exception of theme wallpaper and wallpaper. So everything else should be off. We'll exit out. We 
Okay, so now you got like a bit of a theme background going on. So now we want to do is we want to launch customize. You have to make sure you sign up with the spicy chicken because it recognizes your iTouch. If not, what it'll do is you'll get an error. Now we click on theme browser. We can click on, let's say, the top 40. And we'll just grab one. We'll do the very first one here. We want to download. Now, what's really great about Customize 2.0 is it allows you to modify everything. Everything from the, um, everything from the Wi-Fi symbol to the, uh, to the battery image to the top bar. Uh, you can do separate icons, docking images, backgrounds, uh, batteries, like the, the charging battery. You can modify everything. So here what you can see, it says apply to the theme to the device, or you can go apply only. And this is where you can actually pick everything you want to apply. So let's say I want to apply the wallpaper. And now my wallpaper will change. So you see that my background wallpaper has changed. So let's say you want to apply the whole theme. Now keep in mind too that when you're doing the customize, some of these themes are, are geared towards the iPhone, so some of the icons may not work. So let's say we click on the theme I one I just did, the BUUF2. And I want to apply the theme to the device. So we exit out. And now that you see that my, my main page has changed, you can see the battery has changed. What I'll do is I'll dim it down after I take a look. And as soon as I open it up, you'll see that everything has changed now. So what I'm going to do for you guys is just do a quick show here. I'm just going to go to brightness and tone it down a bit. Exit out. And now you can see my battery and my slider, how, uh, how different it is. And that is how you use Customize 2.0. It's that simple, easy to fix. Uh, sorry, not easy, easy, easy fix to have it done as long as you have that uh, um, the SUID installed, and also that you need to go to spicychicken.com in order to uh, have your iTouch registered or your iPhone. And that's it. So I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Visit jailbreakitouch.com. Sign up as a member. And thanks a lot, guys. Talk to you later.